tax deductible too. <laughs> <laughs> Rob, don't go there. They get, it, they get pretty blue as we go on. <laughs> We've in fact invited uh, a good friend of ours in to uh, kind of help wrap up the year because he's someone who's pretty much had his finger on the pulse throughout 2006 uh, as host of Triple M's Get This. Would you please welcome Mr Tony Martin. <laughs> Busy year go by, a lot of highlights. I have, and uh, can I just mention my Christmas present that I got? Someone yes. gave me a bootleg copy of the uh, embarrassing recording that Yoko Ono's chauffeur was threatening to release. It was just the last oh. album, turns out. <laughs> <laughs> Has someone done the bingle joke? Yeah. Uh, yeah. I'm sorry. <laughs> That's uh, pretty much all I had. Now, you've you played a lot of... Uh, one of the great things about Get This is it, it's audio only, of course, but we yes. hear some am amazing clips. Well, I brought in my favourite five clips clips from Top the year, oh, and I, I think <laughs> you probably know what one of them's going to be. It's that fantastic piece of poetry, that's what I call it, from Rex Hunt. I mean, I, I can't oh. even remember what he was accused of doing, and I don't even think it matters anymore. <laughs> it's just that fantastic sort of haiku that he issued. Have we, have we got that here? Have a look. I'm invincible. I'm paying money. Uh, the girl's happy. She's got no money. I got my rocks off. Oh, how good is this? There it is. <laughs> that actually became a ringtone on your show. <laughs> and people just use those phrases in everyday life now. Just You'll just say, in. you know, how's your holiday going? You'll say to someone and they'll go, oh, the girl's happy. <laughs> <laughs> how much did you pay for that car? Oh, I'm paying money. <laughs> just weave those phrases into everyday conversation. I think my other uh, favourite clip from the news... And it's very quick, and I think this bloke is... is I think his name is Brian Boyd. He's a, a union leader in Victoria. Have a look at this. John Howard is as welcome in Melbourne today as a yellow-bellied black snake in a barbecue! Uh, <laughs> that, that makes a fantastic ringtone as well. <laughs> it's a great way to answer the Because you actually didn't really have to define the no, snake. He's narrowed it down <laughs> to a particular <laughs> species. Not only a black snake. A yellow yellow elite. Elite black snake. As opposed is there to such a thing? Have you checked? I haven't checked, and mm. I understand he talks like that all the time. So <laughs> yeah. just Given like the, the fact library. that every Australian snake is poisonous, you yeah. really yes. don't have to... <laughs> No, no. Any, any serpent would be less than welcome at your outdoor uh, sure. eating event. Uh, clips, I mean, do you guys go to YouTube? I mean, mm, that's yeah. where the... Uh, yeah. What did they... They paid... Google paid, like, $15 Billions. billion mm. dollars for just... Because they had to have all of those clips of cats leaping into the sink, <laughs> <laughs> dancing in their underpants in their bedroom. And there's entire <laughs> categories on, on YouTube, like, I think you mentioned pinata accidents. Yeah, you yeah, basically <laughs> just see <laughs> children basically hitting other children at parties. <laughs> it, I wonder, it's probably sort of taken the wind out of Funniest Home Videos in it a is. way. It's more sort of real life kind of stuff that, that I get into. Uh, my favourite is Drunk in Police Station. No. Have you seen that one? No. no. You, oh. Have a look at this man, Drunk in Police Station. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's more. Stand up here. We'll stand over here. Just when you think he's Put finished. Your hands on the tape. One here. <laughs> 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 that, uh, what the ultimate, the ultimate ignominy is he's actually put his head yes. <laughs> through a wall and he's got his bum crack showing. You <laughs> <laughs> don't have, have to fingerprint the guy. He's just got to go the of his head. But if that's not enough, I think my favourite YouTube clip, and we can't show the whole thing, but Dancing Dog. Have you seen Dancing Is Dog? Is this the Olivia Newton-John? Yeah, yeah. It's, it's the, the film Grease as it should always have been done. <laughs> have a look at this. <laughs> and that's a three-minute routine. We're only seeing a bit of it. It's a taste of what you've got to see Her there. home life. Now, how... how Because, yes, you say they virtually do the entire song, don't they? Yeah. Oh, it's how they manage to follow the cues, I'm not sure. And lots of schmackos, I guess, just weaving, weaving the dog. You've got it. Do you have a Labrador, Tom? Uh, golden, golden Retriever. Does anyone have a Labrador here? The... Mm -hmm. uh, there's no off switch on the eating. <laughs> <laughs> They'll eat until they die. Yeah. They, no. will, they will. They There's will. just no... Yeah. It's, our dog turns into, like, a, a coffee table. Do you get that sort of flat back? <laughs> and you know it's really bad when there's, like, mug rings. <laughs> and, uh, magazines fan. Can I just say, I went round to Tony's place one day to talk about something, I can't remember what it was, and he said, don't touch the dog 
it has a disease we think may be able to be passed to humans. Oh. Is that correct? Yeah, it's um, overeating. <laughs> <laughs> but not like a SARS encephalitis. I, I, I already got because I'd patted it, lift my hand, and I'm thinking, I, yeah. I, I ran my hand under hot water for some time. We do disinfect all this. And <laughs> the other day, I started licking my balls. So, <laughs> It's a pilot for a new show on, on Channel 10. If, if there was one clip, though, in, in, that you felt could sum up the year... Uh, Tony Bullimore, I think. Do we know mm, Tony Bullimore? Yeah. Mm. Incompetent yachtsman. Yes. He's <laughs> cocked up before. He's, you know... He was the guy that was rescued Rescued the... several times. Yeah, right. And then sort of disappeared from radio mm. contact this year. Yes. Mm. Had to come back into port. You're thinking, coming back into port, that would be, there's cameras there, mm. that would be the time to demonstrate your competence mm. as a yachtsman. <laughs> Have a look at his arrival back in port. Here he comes. Oh, no. <laughs> 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 Tony Horn. <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> No ability to <laughs> distinguish between water and land. That's, that seems to be the problem. What I learned from that is that even when you're trying to save your life, you still go, whoa. <laughs> well, I think, I think that clip in many ways sums yeah. up 2006. Mm. Thank you for ta uh, sharing your highlights with us. I get this back next year on... Yeah, I understand it's not been axed yet. So. <laughs> and, and the drunk guy we can find out? Uh, that guy is... YouTube. YouTube, yes. YouTube. A drunk in police station. You shall find him. Would you please thank Mr Tony Martin? <laughs> Thank you.